Hey guys, first of all, thanks for making the GeoFiber review video the most viewed video on my channel. I've been getting a lot of questions regarding the Live TV, whether the Live TV works with 399 or 699 plan, which channels do we get in the 999 plan, is the experience good? So I'll be answering all those in this video. Do check my other GeoFiber videos if it's your first time on my channel and subscribe for more such content. Now let's get started. Unlike the DTH setup box we use that work through satellite connections brought to the setup box using coaxial cable, the live TV on Geo setup box presently works only via internet. There's Geo TV Plus app that has live TV channels to browse through. Some work through OTT apps like Hotstar, Z5 or SonyLive and some open directly. There's also a dedicated live TV option on the home screen, which is supposed to work through satellite but that's not activated yet. In future, Geo will join hands with Hathway, Den and similar DTH service providers and provide the DTH experience at an extra cost. You heard it right, at an extra cost. So when it's available, I'll let you guys know it. Though it's been clear that you won't be getting any free OTT subscriptions with 399 and 699 plan, it is not been made clear if the live TV channels would work or not. So let me clear that. If you have the Geo setup box, some of the live TV channels actually work even with the 399 and 699 plan. I have been on the 699 plan last month and I was able to play many channels. But obviously the major channels from Z, Star or Sony won't work as they need the OTT app subscription to work. This is the most asked question on my channel. Unfortunately, there's no readily available list anywhere about how many channels we get in the Geo TV Plus. So I had to literally make a list manually by opening every channel on the setup box. I made an online Excel sheet listing out all the channels you will get with the Geo TV Plus as on May 2021. You can access the link from the video description. So there are a total of 487 live channels in the Geo TV Plus if you take 999 or above plan out of which around 341 channels work with 399 and 699 plan. I have clearly listed out the channel numbers, the playback quality of the channel, whether it plays in HD or SD, the language, its category, which channels work with 399 and 699 plan and which doesn't. You can easily use the search function to look for the channel of your interest. or else you can use the filter option by selecting the first row and clicking on this option on the top to create a filter. Then you can sort out the channels according to your need. For example, if you want to see just the HD channels list, click on the filter here and use the sort feature. If you want the list of only movie channels, go to category column and use the sort feature to get all the movie channels list together. And let's say if you want just the channels that work with 399 and 699 plan, then choose this column and sort. All the channels with yes mentioned will work with 399 and 699 plan. Basically, if you have observed the pattern, any channel that plays through Z5, Hotstar or Sony Live won't work with 399 and 699 plan. There's a big list that works, but most of them won't be your primary requirement. As we are getting so many live TV channels with the 999 plan, you might think, can we stop our DTH connection and use this instead? My answer is no, and here's why. You cannot access the live TV channels directly from home screen. You have to go into the Geo TV Plus app, then the Live TV section to access them. Directly pressing the channel number also works only when you are in the channel guide page. Changing from one channel to other also isn't easy. 
Let's say you're watching a channel and want to switch to another. You cannot just press the number or press next. You have to press back to go to the Jio TV Plus and then go to another channel. All the channels that work through Z5 or Sony Live or Disney Plus Hotstar don't open directly when we open. They first load the app and then starts the channel. So you have to wait till the channel loads. And this happens even when you want to exit. You have to press back 3 to 4 times to select another channel which is a major inconvenience. If you check the list I shared, though the total number of channels seem huge, there are many major channels missing both in English and regional languages. For example, HBO, Romedy Now, ETV, Star Movies are some channels which I watch but they are missing. Hindi channels are mostly covered with very few missing. So if the list covers most of the channels you generally watch, then you are lucky. As the playback is through internet, some of the channels have a lot of smearing issues. It looks like the image is breaking especially in the HD channels on Disney Plus Hotstar and Z5. Even the ads in the star channels are weird. So if you have a large TV, 43 inch or above, then you would not surely enjoy the playback experience. Now if you are someone who uses a DTH connection regularly, then you know how much the content guide helps in knowing what's playing now and what's coming next. But here you have to come back to the channel guide every time to see what's going to come next. Finally, it's surely good to have so many channels included for free with the plans. But it cannot replace the DTH experience totally. Especially if you want specific channels. Even the user experience is not elderly friendly. I personally don't use DTH much and mostly watch OTT content. So for me, this is a good option to have when I don't know what to watch. But if my parents are gonna stay with me, I'm surely getting the DTH connection back. Hope this helps in clearing your doubts about the live TV and the excel sheet helps you in decide if all the content you need is available or not. Let me know in the comments if there's a specific video you want me to make on the Geofiber. Stay home and stay safe.